Hey everybody, Thrash to Death here. Just wanted to talk briefly today about um, a new song that hit the internet a couple of days ago by American doom metal band uh, While Heaven Wept. Um, While Heaven Wept are a fairly underground band who have just recently in the last couple of years been uh, making moves towards the mainstream. Their last album, 2009's uh, of Vast, La Vast Ocean to Lacrimos, hope I said that right, um, was released to a fair amount of critical acclaim and just recently they've signed a deal with Nuclear Blast Records. They've got their new album Fear of Infinity coming out on April the 22nd and just two days ago uh, there was a live recording of the first ever performance of their new track Obsessions Now Effigies um, from a festival in Athens. Um, this song, about four minutes long, is a relatively uh, standard for them epic doom metal track. Um, starts off with a based around a fairly straightforward, simple uh, dual guitar harmony. Um, it goes for this very sort of epochal, elegiac sound in sort of the candle mass uh, sort of vein. Um, go, just sort of build up, building on that basic riff um, as only epic doom metal can, just sort of building and building on this sort of one very relatively simple idea to, towards this climax where it just sort of breaks out into this really dense heavy uh, chugging riff and it's a really well structured song, really well written um, and the sound quality, I'll include a link to the video in uh, the description um, very good um, performance from the band members even though the sound quality obviously live recording not perfect um, yeah the it's, um, While Heaven Wept are sort of um, they, along with uh, their former label mates, Atlantean Codex, seem to be part of a new movement towards this sort of um, almost simplified form of epic metal. Um, I think I've heard it referred to in some, some circumstances as myth metal. Um, it sort of has this very sort of simple, very narrative uh, sort of riff style. Often long songs, this one four minutes long was uh, probably one of the shortest ones I've heard in this style. Um, takes cues from Candlemas, but at the same time Bathory as well. Um, with um, While Heaven Wept going into Nuclear Blast Records and um, the emergence of Atlantean Codex on Cruz del Sur, um, I'm sort of hoping that this sort of trend catches on into the mainstream because I would like to hear more bands doing this sort of sound. Um, although for me, probably the biggest draw for While Heaven Wept's music is is um, their vocalist Rain Irving. He, um, he's got this very grandiose uh, operatic uh, style, very, totally in sync with um, the band's epochal, uh, epic sort of style of riffing. But at the same time it's sort of tender and intimate at the same time. Very sort of emotionally resonant and it's just a very great vocal styling that more metal vocalists can do to try. I often get the impression that um, too many metal vocalists sort of pigeonhole themselves willingly into the sort of stereotypes of either the sort of power metal vocalist who's just concerned with hitting as many high notes for as long as possible, or the sort of guttural growler who's just sort of shouting out syllables as fast as possible without anyone understanding them. And I do like it when uh, metal vocalists, obviously there are good singers within those archetypes, but I like it when there are more vocalists who break out of those archetypes as well. Rain Irving's definitely one of those. Um, so yeah, While well, Heaven Wept, uh, definitely a band to keep your eye on at the moment. Fear of Infinity, probably one of my most anticipated albums of 2011, and that should be out um, April 22nd. As it is, you can listen to this new track. Pretty good song, song uh, recording quality for a live video. So definitely check that one out uh, while, it's, while it's up. Um, anyway, that's me for now. Um, Thrash to death, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.